Philippines as it promotes a modern lifestyle, steering the youth away from their cultural roots. But success of a local website proves otherwise. www.proudlyindian.co.za celebrates the rich heritage of the Indian origin community, and in the four months since its launch, it's attracted 800 registered users, most of them young people. My Jagjeevan reports. A click of the mouse and hitting the right letters on the keyboard to share your thoughts is all it takes to be part of the Proudly Indian website. The site is the brainchild of Peter Marisburg based computer science teacher Jeremiah Padiachi and his brother Jude. Jeremiah says their late grandfather A.S. Pele, who is believed to be the country's highest honored soldier of color who participated in World War II, was their inspiration. We are proud of our granddad to actually have achieved such high ranking. There's hundreds of other Indians out there who have accomplished great things, which is what the whole website is about, is to build great scenes and uh, sound. And then we had family photos of salaries. So we just started off with all our immediate family information and then recipes from around the house. And from there, users started responding and most of the stuff is from actually the users itself. The current 800 registered users range in age from 18 to 57, and it's not limited to local users. The main area is PMB, Durban, Joburg, as well as we have a lot of people that used to live in South Africa who have now moved abroad, places like Chicago, London, Dallas, Texas. In fact, Jeremiah says the website is not only for members of the Indian community. Although the name says proudly Indian, it's not strictly for Indians. The site is actually for everybody who loves our Indian culture. I actually have a lot of users that are not Indian. Staying true to Indian roots, Three red chilies form the website's logo. As most people uh, refer to Indians, everything is about curry and curry beef. Jeremiah says they do not engage in religious debates and anything found to be degrading or offensive is removed from the site. If you create an account, you are allowed to post in the blogs and the forums. However, because of people posting things that are offensive, all the blogs and the forums are monitored. And if we find something that may be offensive to some of our users, we remove them and then we contact the person that posted it and explain our reasons for doing that. Jeremiah is currently working on creating an extensive profile of his grandfather and his achievements for the website. And in the near future, users will be able to upload their wedding pictures and home videos. Jeremiah's mother has also come on board the project and is working on an interesting new addition to the site. She's writing on the old Indian remedies, medical remedies. Oh, they actually work quite well, surprisingly. That report by Maya Jagjeevan. Well, we're coming into the final quarter of our program. Stay tuned. More